Thank you, thank you for subscribing. Thank you so much, even though I haven't been posting videos. Thank you guys so much. And to my old subscribers, I love you guys so much. And I am here because of y'all. <laughs> Honestly, um, thank you so much, guys. You have been away, guys. A lot has been happening. And I remember on my last video, I promised you guys that I'll post or I'll upload at least one video per week but you know life man you know life we plan it decides so that's what happened and i'm so sorry guys but i'm back now and i am doing a get to know me video today because i've been asked a lot of questions on social media and um i just realized that i need to do it because people need to know how to give people what they want so i'm doing that <laughs> So, yeah, I got most of my questions from social media. I got from my former classmates and my friends as well. So, I wrote all the questions on this book. I'm going to be reading from the book. Um, okay, so my first question... I'm not going to be long, guys. I'm not, going to, I'm not here to waste your time. Time is of the essence. I'm not going to be long. I'm not. I promise. <laughs> so, okay. My first, qu first question is... What is your name? Seriously, guys? Okay, well, what is your name and what does it mean? My name is Sheila. Sheila Unetsi Palerileng. And the Sheila name, I get it from my grandmother, my mom's mother. Yes, um, I was named after her. The Unetsi name, apparently my dad gave it to me and yeah, it never really worked my entire life until now. And... <coughs> I'm sorry guys <clears throat> um i also have a nickname which everyone knows me by sasa that's the name everyone calls me um but i really really appreciate those who call me unnets because i feel that's like my real name that's my 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 african name that's you know what i mean so <laughs> yes and unnetsi means uh given umpile you know uh undipile yes yes mm -hmm. that's what it means um and i love my name so much you guys because it's rare it's unique because we are rare mm -hmm. okay the other question is where are you from and where were you born okay i'm from kajiso um in the west end it's uh a location in the west end near krugersdorp yeah. that's where i'm from and i was born at uh, can I get spit a little? oh coronation hospital now known to be um raima musa hospital that's where i was born okay third question what are your favorite things about yourself okay, favorite things about myself is the fact that i come across as very confident <laughs> even though i know sometimes i'm like uh why why am I not like this for real? <laughs> um, it's that and my smile. I love my smile a lot, you guys. Um, I love the fact that um, I don't know. I'm I'm myself, you know. I'm not trying to be anybody else. That's the other thing I like about myself. Um, okay. Next question. What is your biggest fear, and what is a, and what is your biggest regret? my biggest fear honestly would be yeah not making it in this life thing yo i can't like that's my biggest fear you know Woo. not being able to achieve my set goals and objectives that that would really yeah be a horror movie to the girl um and my biggest regret i don't have any 
for now i'm not regretting anything no i'm not okay um next question what is your favorite who is your favorite celebrity my favorite celebrity is bonang mateba queen b herself and the reason why i love her so much you guys is how she motivates herself you know how she tells herself for yes is mugele kya batsena and kya nyisa and i am who i am no one is going to tell me and i need no uh what do you call it english i don't need validation from anybody that's why i love her so much she's my favorite celebrity um okay next question if you could eliminate one weakness in your life what would it be <sighs> it would be um my inability to say no even though i know i am not comfortable or i am i don't want to do it you know um in the sense of me maybe helping someone with a favor you know like maybe someone comes to me and says um hi Unetsi, can you please do this for me even though i know i don't want to do this i'll just look at the person and say okay because you know i have this excuse me pity that i feel for other people even though i know this is going to waste my time i don't have the time to do this but i'm going to do it anyway because yeah i feel sorry for other people next question oh where do you draw your inspiration from mm. to be honest i draw my inspiration from my mom uh my mom has a very positive impact in my life you know um not because she's my mom no but because of how of how she deals with problems in her life of how she she faces her challenges you know like man yo you know my mom always tells me that um whatever makes you happy whatever makes you fulfilled do it today because you don't know if tomorrow you are going to wake up you know if you want if you have the money to buy yourself an apple today buy it and eat it because tomorrow is not promised you know so she tells me die a happy person <laughs> um and yeah yo yeah my mom guys okay we're not here about my mom anyways the other thing i draw inspiration from the other person actually i draw inspiration from is bonang i did see why i love her so much because mugele she's her own cheerleader you know she 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 cheers up for herself so much and i love that I love that because th those are the things that inspire us you know because sometimes you feel very low and like people will yeah people will do you bad guys to a point where you start thinking that you're not good enough or you stop believing in yourself and who you are but bonang man you know people are not gonna tell you this they are not so why don't you tell yourself why don't you tell yourself because if you don't tell yourself where are you going to get the extra boost from hmm. yes that's my my that's where i draw my inspiration from honestly okay next question um can you whistle yes seriously can i whistle of course i can ah <laughs> uh, next question the one thing you had the biggest problem getting over oh, the one thing i had the biggest problem getting over was my first heartbreak yo 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 it was tough guys yo i like it took me time to get over the pain like it took me time honestly i'm not gonna lie to you and say it took me a year and then i was like oh yeah i'm fine i'm fine inside my heart no it took me oh it took me a long time it took me a long time it did <laughs> but i'm over it now and yeah at least this time i know i mean it's not gonna go illegal you know i'm fine even though i knew i was not so yeah next question 
do you have a birthmark if so then where yes i do have a birthmark guys on my what's this left left arm i don't know if you can see it yeah that's my birthmark um <coughs> do you have a best friend i don't like giving people titles honestly like because people can hurt you people will hurt you you know what i mean <laughs> um but yes i do have a best friend and my best friend is my daughter i love her so much she's just as dramatic as i am but you would but worse like very worse yeah next question um favorite musician yeah those who know me know that i love king monada with all my heart and not only him but his music his music do you feel angry hadira music man one kakanya man one 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 nakana man because ha it's what your music happy hello my ring maguela maguela monada yeah yo unka nkata wikhala kontle kanta litsele ka anisa ba fiti ka tsila ka gore wa that's how much i love him monada thank you <laughs> <laughs> um what other languages besides english and your native language do you speak i speak afrikaans i'm not perfect guys ne? but i can engage with african speaking people <laughs> for example just to, to say hello you know uh who my name is Sheila Unetzi Balerling. Um I play in Kahiso and Khanama Kenis. I can stay in contact here out and I have fun. Masik. Um next question. Are you more like your mom or your dad? I'm definitely more like my mom. More like my mom. I'm a very sweet person. My mom is. So I am more like her. 16. What are some of your bad habits? Biting my nails. As you can see, I don't have any. 2. I talk to myself. Yes, I do that. 3. I like sleeping at people's places. Yes. <clears throat> I'll act as if I didn't say that. <laughs> next question when will you know you've made it in life when will i know i've made it in life i think because i don't want to put myself under so much pressure and give myself an ultimatum i'd say i have obviously a person each and every person has their own long-term goals at least maybe if i have achieved two of my long-term goals then i'll know if i'll know that i've made it in life yes um the last question is what is a relationship deal breaker for you okay guys i'm not gonna mention boo dishonesty um disrespect because i think that that is just a deal breaker for everyone you know you don't like yeah so my relationship deal breaker would be someone who is not future orientated if you are not future orientated that honey back me Leicester J it's not going to work because why I am a very future orientated person and I don't think I would want to be with someone who is not because firstly if you are not Ribatona guys we are old I don't think you would be you would want to be in a relationship just in jail for the fun of it no right now time is of the essence is of the essence time is of the essence yeah now go. time waits for no man time you can't waste that time because time flies guys and the minute you wake up you are like what i wasted five years of my life unfocused you know so i don't think someone who's not future orientated would work out with me because i don't want to feel like you have now become a burden you know because i know for a fact that you need to work for the future it just doesn't come on a silver platter you know so 
<coughs> if someone doesn't want to work for themselves and see um, themselves somewhere in the near future, then I'm sorry. Game over. <laughs> ah, guys, okay, those were the questions. And yeah, thank you so much, guys, for watching and tuning in. Um, please don't forget to subscribe and like and do comment down below guys do comment i love comments like they make me happy <laughs> so um if there is anything else that you would love to ask me please do comment down below and i will see you guys next time